wanted to share a success story that we had um, really excited about this. We bought this house uh, that was looking great, but it had um, in the backyard, it had a, a large wall, like you were staring at a you know, very high wall and uh, up the wall there are houses that potentially can look at the house. Uh, there was another objection and uh, when we toured the house first I was doing a video and uh, was saying that basically I think our main objection uh, with this house is going to be that uh, back wall and um, I was actually concerned about the camp because in that area the, the camp which is the, the value the comparable it varies a lot there are these the houses this exact house is selling anywhere between 300 or 310 uh, 310,000 all the way to 370,000 and the variation is mainly the backyard is um, you know what do you have in the backyard if you have a view you know that's great that, that you could get as high as 370 for that house uh, but the ones with a smaller backyard and maybe a wall behind would get closer to 310 so we were like a little concerned that maybe you know with this backyard we may be closer to that 310 um, but um, I wanted to share with you what I said there and then what happened. So I'll play this really quick here. For us on this house, this is the video I did uh, the main thing first time we went there. so beautiful that you know it takes away from uh, worrying about a high wall behind you which some people will uh, hopefully they'll see uh, you know I think we're gonna focus a lot on the yard in this one it's gonna be beautiful and that's gonna be our main selling feature for this house other than that you see it's in all it's right in so that's it great. so uh, let me minimize this oh, actually So this is the after, I'll show you this video, this is what, uh, what it looked like when we were done. The fan was there, and this fan also. Alright, so the backyard, I think now we can, uh, I think we... I'm going to pause this for a second. So, um, it wasn't as beautiful as I, as I imagined it to be at first. I imagined that we would do more work. Uh, but the way it happened, you know, it, it just happened this way. I to cut the story short, uh, I thought this was um, this was achieving our, our objective. I said in in the video objection. So uh, I thought we were achieving our obje objective here, and um, so I'll show you the video here. on the plus uh, before it was kind of a negative that there is a, uh, a high uh, back wall some buyers don't like it and um, but now, now I think we're focused on how beautiful it is it's clean it's big it's a pretty good size backyard uh, we put the fireplace uh, people do it's getting cold here in Vegas so it's nice to see that fireplace. We still are going to add some color. It's missing some color. So we're gonna add some bushes, uh, chunky rock around the trees. Chunky. All right. So the house finally closed. We sold it. We sold it for a lot better than that uh, low 310 number. And uh, But what's exciting is when the agent called me, uh, the buyer's agent called me, she said, you know, uh, first of all, can they buy the exterior furniture because they're in love with it? And she she told me I gotta I have to tell you that that's the main reason they're buying the house is because they love the backyard, they love what you did with it, they love the uh, the fireplace, they're thinking about hosting, and um, that's the main reason they want this house. So just very exciting uh, when you do something, you put up a little bit of thought into what you do and a little bit extra effort. Usually when we do staging we don't touch the backyard. The staging is for the house only. In this case, uh, specifically ask the stager 
to put more importance on the exterior, uh, put some nice furniture, put a fireplace for, you know, for the vision and, um, and that sense, uh, the holidays are coming and the cold and so it worked out. So just wanted to share this, uh, this story with you, very exciting and um, we'll keep posting on our uh, other projects. Take care.